Hi guys, today I want to show you how to create a full width header in Maca. What it basically is, it's a header which has its text set to a certain width, but the background of the header will adjust to the full width of the browser window. And let's start by adjusting our canvas so it's easier for you to follow. Okay, should be fine. Let's create a background for our header, expand it, okay. and let's choose some nice color. All right, now the text. Let's adjust it a bit. that one, white, and let's increase the size, okay, looks fine, and let's, let's expand that as well, I'm using command E, and let's create some body copy and I'm going to generate three paragraphs of lorem ipsum and just hitting tab now okay that's fine let's expand it as well Okay, so one thing I want to do is to add some paddings on the sides so it, the text won't touch the browser window. And let's add 20 pixels of paddings on the side. And I used shift clicking to select them both at the same time. Okay, 20 pixels fine here and here as well. Okay, let's test it. Okay, now it's for the moment it, it doesn't work, but let's make it work. I can move that inside the D, inside the background. And what I need to make sure is that the background expands to the full width so it should be defined in percentages okay and the text should have static width okay that's fine and that also should have static width okay all right so the background expands but what I would like to have is for the text and the header uh, to be aligned to the center. Let's do that by setting the origin to the center for the text and the same for copy. And let's also adjust uh, the background. It's not necessary, but everything will work better. Okay, let's test it now. All right, it seems, it seems to work fine. But what we're actually not seeing for the moment is what will happen if the browser window goes below uh, our desired width. So the text will be cut off. We can force the text to adjust to the full width of the browser window under 600 pixels. So let's do that now. And we actually need to add a new breakpoint above 600 pixels because at this breakpoint at 600 we want the text to be full width. 
So let's add one at, at 640. And I'm choosing 640 because Maca doesn't allow uh, the breakpoints to be closer than 40 pixels. So that's our default one now. And let's work at 600 pixels. I want to make sure that this text is set to 100% and the copy 100% as well. Let's publish. Okay, so it works great above our breakpoint. It works nice below, but there are some problems when you go to, to a really lower width because the text doesn't seem to uh, force the force its background to expand and we can adjust that easily we can either adjust it for all the breakpoints or just for this one and let's let's just uh, adjust it for this one so i want the header to be its height to be auto so based on its children and i'm just deleting that value And one more thing, we need to add some paddings. And I think 10 pixels should be enough. And now move the text, delete its top margin. So it looks like that. Let's double check when publishing. And that's exactly what we want. So it looks perfect under every width. So if we go below, uh, above a certain width, it starts to, um, I mean, only the header background starts to adjust and the text remain remains at a set width. And below a certain breakpoint, we've got a nice fluid layout which adjusts to the size of the browser. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching today and bye bye.